If you just finished watching the David Rudman Domino's Pizza Toyota 2007 164 diecast review, congratulations. If you haven't, I recommend going back there to watch the video before watching this one as I briefly explained the whole 2007 David Rudman rookie season. And now we're going to be reviewing his second car that was produced in the COI series. Rudman only had four 2007 164s, well technically five 2007 164s produced, two COIs which were the, the Domino's Pizza and the Burger King Toyota Camrys and then he had two COTs produced which were the Domino's Pizza and the BK and the Burger King Toyotas. He also had one Bush Series diecast produced as a promo and that was the 99 uh, Best Western Toyota Camry for Michael Walter Bracing, but we're not going to be reviewing that Bush Series promo itself as a as I don't have it currently and it's not available to my reach. However, though, we're going to be reviewing the sister counterpart, which is the two, which is the Burger King Toyota from two, the 2007 David Rudman rookie season for Michael Walter Bracing. Just like the Domino's Pizza box, I love the box design itself. The Burger Burger King logo, along with the pit stop, all of that hood. I love the BK flame broiled scheme. That is just oh so cool. Oh it's so awesome. Alright, let's take it out of the package. Let's get it out of the package. It's been dying to come out now. Yeah, I brought these from home because I wanted to do the reviews at my dorm because what else do I got better to do than just taking a break from studying and doing diecast review is my favorite thing. So here we got the car itself. Uh, the colors are primarily black, uh, orange, yellow, and then you have the BK logo, which is all um, orange, blue, red. Got the Rudiman uh, double zero font. Got, it's all white and red. Uh, white interior with a red outside line. Gotta have it your way. Look at that BK logo. I love the old BK logo because this reminds me of 2007 when, uh, especially when the Simpsons movie came out and when Burger King went all out marketing for the Simpsons movie. And that was actually the last time they ever did Burger King uh, tie-in with the Simpsons. Like after 2007, they disappeared because Burger King for a long period of time actually sponsored the Simpsons. They featured the Simpsons in a number of commercials in the 90s and early 2000s, especially with the discontinued Burger King Big Kids meal. You were able to get like a, a spooky, like especially during Halloween, they had like uh, they had like a, they had like some sort of like weird um, like freezy, which I want them to bring back. I've already t asked them on like Twitter, Facebook, like hey, could you bring those back during Halloween? That would be really cool. Uh, nothing yet, though, sadly, but, um, anyways, see, well, we're kind of getting a little off topic with the Simpsons going back to the car itself. I just love that front hood with the old mid-2000s, mid-late 2000s BK logo, because this was just when Burger King was literally on its height and not plunging into what it's become today, because it's kind of a big of a joke now. I mean, I do go to Burger King once in a while just to, like, because I think their ice cream is very underrated, and I love their Whoppers, and their fries are pretty good as well, but it's just McDonald's that's been kicking their asses all freaking time for the last decade now. But for a while, Burger King what did have that nice sponsorship with uh, Michael Walter Bracing before going to Stuart Haas Racing, uh, in 2009, where they um, just stayed there until leaving 2011, and then Ron Devine, as a Burger King franchise owner, used Burger King as just um, paid as like a paid advertisement way to just sponsor his car. He wasn't sponsored by Burger King. He always just used Burger King as the sponsor if they couldn't even find a sponsor, which was pretty much all the time for that team for BK Racing in 2012. Um. Side, I love that flame pattern. That flame pattern is awesome. You got the flame broiled logo for Burger King, your flame broiled whoppers. Who doesn't love a flame, flame broiled whopper? On the deck lid, you got the Burger King logo. Just screams mid late 2000s. And then on the rear, along with the rookie stripes, you gotta have it your way. You gotta have it your way. That's the literal, that's the pretty much the ideal of Burger King. You've got to have it your way. 
Um, Rudiment itself with the Burger King car didn't have much success with it, like the Domino's car. He ran other variations of, of the Burger King car that I would love to get customs of one of these days, such as the, um, there was an Xbox 360 one that, that was, um, that was ran, never got offered, as well as the Simpsons, uh, Burger King, which was also ran, that was ran at Indianapolis, though, and it, uh, lost an engine very early in the race. So eventually I would love to get a custom of that. I'll probably reach out to some people if they want to try and make that happen because I would pay good money to get a David Rudiman uh Simpsons movie uh Burger King Burger King Simpsons movie uh custom produced for my collection uh once again we'll, we'll flip it over uh 2007 as I stated Motorsports Authentics was your local um was the your king of NASCAR diecast production for both Winter Circle and Action. So this would be bought either at the track or you would get, or you would be able to obtain this at your uh, local diecast dealer itself. But anyways, thank you so much for watching this diecast review. I know it's been a little bit of a while since I made a video. I mean, it's been probably a couple days, but still, we'll have more diecast reviews coming out all like next month long because I will be on G term and I'll have plenty of time to do diecast reviews. If you have a suggestion for a diecast review, please comment it comment it down below or just reach out to me on Twitter, Instagram, or Discord because I would love to have a huge list of cust of um, just diecast review, especially if you want one that's requested. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. Have a good one. Peace out. Take care. Keep on collecting.